So I wasn't even gonna make a video about this, but I saw this project on GitHub and it perfectly demonstrates how folder structure can impact the speed of development and running scripts like linting, testing, or building, or whatever. And here's a visualization of the files in this repository. So we have a couple of special ones. It's color coded by file type. So, uh, but you'll notice ngrx is a folder that has only one type of file in it. So this is separated by technology. This is, these are uh, like reducers, selectors, and effects. And each one of these corresponds to a feature. So it's like they took out the NGRX stuff from each of these features and put it into one central NGRX folder. And we've got this types library as well. Um, it just has one index file, but that's got something from all the libraries as well. So to demonstrate how folder structure impacts development and everything, I added this feature here. It's a counter, so it does what you would expect. To implement this, I had to work in four completely different deeply nested folders. So this is really annoying. After I refactored to a separation by concern, like feature rather than technology, um, and I edited that feature. I only had to touch two different folders. And here's the NX dependency graph from when I first added the counter feature. I had to add a type for the counter state. And since every everything is importing from that central types folder, that means the affected graph includes pretty much everything, just with that alone. But NGRX also has a lot of dependencies. So um, multiple reasons, tons of projects were affected. And it's pretty much really tiny features that weren't affected. After I refactored and edited the counter feature, it only affected the counter feature and nav. So the vast majority of code was not affected. So as expected, it takes a lot less time to run scripts against the affected projects when it's organized by feature rather than technology. So the test, they took almost a minute before and after they took just over 10 seconds and linting took four seconds before and two seconds after. But for me personally, the biggest benefit was being able to spend the vast majority of development time in just one single folder. This nav component, all I did was just add a link. The vast majority of time was spent editing files in just one folder. It was kind of like a home. And the vast majority of tasks you need to do as a developer involve individual features rather than technologies that span multiple features. And even if you do need to do some task that involves one technology across many features, you can just filter by file extension, and there you go, all the files that use that one technology. Pretty cool, huh? There's a lot more I could say about this, but I already wrote this article called Why Your Folder Structure Sucks. It talks about how to deal with circular dependencies and other consequences of uh, separating by technology rather than feature. So I'll link to this in the description. And yeah, uh, yeah, I highly recommend organizing by feature rather than technology. That is much more often the primary concern that you want to separate by. So yeah. Thanks for watching, and if you have any questions, let me know.